We are pretty much nearing the end, folks. Welcome back again to some more Lost in Random. We went through a lot of trouble of finally getting that dream card to get us to where we are today, which is the new area of Sextropolis. So we're going to continue on from there and see where it goes. So if anything else, guys, I hope you all continue to enjoy. Let's get on with it. All right, guys, welcome back. Here we are again, and we finally made it to Sextopia. I don't understand. Is this really it? Maybe this is like a fake Sextopia, meant to confuse invaders or something? Very cardboardy. Like every other area was more real. But Sextopia is more, I guess, imaginative, almost childlike. Maybe the queen's a child. And she's just playing as an adult. I don't believe this! Sextopia is supposed to be this whole wondrous place that grown-ups have been telling us about. Since the day we were born. And it's fake. It's all a lie. What is going on? None of this makes sense. Oh, jump, no. Oh, Stu, what mischief have you gotten yourself into this time? Who's talking? Now, now, Annabelle, we use our polite words around others. Good morning, lovelies. Good morning, Charles. Why don't you look handsome today? <laughs> oh, heck, I'm just the same old man I always was, but bless your heart for lying, lovelies. <laughs> oh, you're here too, Albert. Hey, ugly. I'm a big, stupid cardboard person, and I'm Charles' least favorite because I'm a mean, stupid idiot who falls apart all the time. Yes, yes, Albert. We're all familiar with your whole deal. Excuse me, uh, Charles? <laughs> What's going on here? We've been here for 60 years. You ought to know what's going on by now. Yeah, what gives? <laughs> Though, of course, not much actually does go on here. <laughs> you stand around and I fix you when you fall apart. Easy. Easy peasy. I'm, I'm not a cardboard cutout. I'm a real girl. Do you take care of these cardboard cutouts? Cutouts? Why, that's a fine way to refer to yourself. Don't be rude. Besides, would a cardboard cutout start talking to me five years into my job here? Eh, it would not. And since you lovelies have been talking to me every day since, let's just say I know you're all more than what you seem. <laughs> Even if Albert here keeps losing his head over this. Huh, you love it. My guy here lost his mind. I can't blame him. Of course you are, obviously. You're all real here. No, I mean, I'm real, but everything else here except you is fake. Charles, until I arrived, you were the only real person here. No, we're real. If we were fake, could my head fall off all the time? Oh, no, 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 don't you dare, Albert. I've had enough of that for today by far. <laughs> oh, what do you mean I'm not real? Oh, now look what you've done. You've hurt Bedelia's feelings. There, there, Bedelia. Oh, she says mean things. I know, I know, I'm gonna talk to her about it, okay? But you're real. We're all real here. You're alone. Alone? Ha! I'm surrounded by friends here. <laughs> There's Bedelia, Claude, Claude 2, Snugglebuns, 8-Ball, Big Tony, Little Tony, Average Tony, the hated Albert. <laughs> Boingy Boingy, Peanut Butter and Jam, they're twins. <laughs> Don, Donner, Donist, Don Ultimate, Don Penultimate, Don Ultra Penult, Don... 
Well, I don't need to tell you their names. We've all been here forever. <laughs> Can you tell me your earliest memory? You, you, you don't talk like the others, do you? She sure doesn't. Should we be suspicious, Charles? I'm very suspicious. No, no, it's okay. <laughs> it's fine to be curious, lovelies. Eh? Yeah, my earliest memory. Hmm. It's when my head first fell off 40 years ago. <sighs> no, it's when me and Pattycakes got married 50 years ago. <laughs> no. No, it was when I was young. Just, just a child, really. The nanny came for me in that, that, that chariot that walked like a spider. She dropped me here, told me my only task in life was to take care of these props. She said my fate was never to be anything more than a forgotten janitor. And then she disappeared. She never came back. But all I've done for every day of my life since then was live here alone. So profoundly alone. Surrounded only by these... These parodies of life mocking me every hour of every day with their ageless faces and painted on smiles and I... <laughs> oh, so I thought... But then five years into it, y'all started talking to me and you've never stopped since. <laughs> and now you're an old man surrounded by friends who'll never die. Ha <laughs> ha, sure am, lovelies. <laughs> Ain't that a blessing? <laughs> Why, I must be the luckiest guy in the whole world. Woohoo! So nobody ever comes here. Not ever. I pass through sometimes. That hardly counts. They go to the tower. Look, I don't want to talk about it. Nanny's chariot passes through on its way to the tower. The children get quieter and quieter as the chariot moves away. Then we never hear them again. Oh, how I could visit them in the tower. What quiet fun they must be having! Has the nanny ever come back? Children, my sister was taken too. Then she's playing up in the tower all day long. How lucky! <laughs> uh, wait. Why would the Creed want the nanny to take one of us cardboard cutouts? It's never happened before! Maybe she isn't really a cardboard cutout like us. <laughs> no, she is. She's just lost her mind, that's all. I'm humoring her, see? <laughs> Tell me about your sister, lovely. <laughs> her name is Odd, and I'm going to save her. Her name is Odd, and I'm worried about her. Now, lovely, I learned long ago it's best not to make promises to yourself you can't keep. Now, where have I heard that name before? Oh, yes! Odd! The Queen graced us with her presence not too long past, and she had a girl with her. Odd, she called her. She wore a white mask, I remember. She looked strange. Strangely happy, yes, as are we all. <laughs> they didn't have time to acknowledge any of us, of course. She's very busy, but they went out that way, right through there. Then right through there is where I'm going. Well, I won't stop you, cardboard lady. <laughs> but hey, say hi to the queen for me. <laughs> Reminder, I'm here. I'm still here. I feel bad for the janitor, man. 
lost his mind five years in. Ah, it's horrible. My glassy is made out of, I don't know, despair. D don't get it on you, buddy. This must be it. The tower. What's inside there, Dicey? I can just feel it. She has to be. All right, it wants me to go there, so I'm gonna go I'm here so for now. Far, haven't we? But I still don't know for sure what you want me to do. Wait, what? Oh. Mm. I've got a card up my sleeve. I don't think he has any more cards I want. <sighs> cards on the table. This is a bit outside my normal rounds, and not at all what I was expecting. But now you're here, and Maddie Dex is playing the sympathy card. You've got to buy something, mate. Please! Manny, I don't understand what happened here. Oh, Manny doesn't try to understand the world. All I understand is cards. And I understand now that perhaps you're looking to trade. You never know who's listening, mate. Now, let's trade and forget all about any treasonous thoughts, eh? <laughs> treasonous thoughts? I'm very curious now. High roller. I have these, but... Uh, yeah. Keep saving money. Alright, let me make sure... I got everything. I should follow the ghost, but... I'm also curious what lays further in here. Unless, it all takes me to the same spot anyway. Which, it seems to me like it does. Okay. Otherwise, I'm just gonna confuse myself. Dice, come on! Yeah, don't split up from me right now, Dicey. I need you. Oh, what is that? Alright, I don't know where I'm going. Mm. Okay, I can't climb up there. Why is it saving? Alright, the ghost was leading me here. Ah, uh, hold on. Yeah, leading me here. Oh, wait. Oh, crap. I'm <laughs> going around circles. <laughs> hold on. Ah. Uh. Alright, let's go this way for now. I went through here, yeah. Manny Dex is there. Wait. Nope. Oh, we're fighting, okay. Clearly we're in the right spot. Oh no, oh no! Oh, nope. Nope! One more time, one more time. No! Ooh, oh yeah, stay in front of the enemy. Ah! Alright, one more time. Alright, we're perfect, let's go. Uh, okay, we'll use this. Use this. I will use this. Most importantly, are you kidding me? Really? Nope. Oh, that was fast. Let's go. Alright, I want this. Give me the sword. Give me this. And... Wait, can I use it here? Hold on. It seems like I can't. Yeah. 
Alright, we get it. Nope. Ow. No. There you go. There you go. See all that? Alright, you have what I want. I'll take this. I will take this. And finally. Ah. Oh. And go. One more should do it. All it, all of it, all of it. All right, we're going straight here. The fight isn't over yet, apparently. Uh oh, 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 oh. Super cheap. Okay. Ah, uh, power up my thing. That's pretty good. Good. One more time. Take care of him. Where am I going? Where am I going? Left. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Ah, come on. Alright, let's serve him. That blast is about to hit me if I'm not careful. I will take some healing. Oh, oh. I'll take that. I'll take that. You know, I can just keep doing this all day. Let's go. Ooh, that was it. Alright, now before I go up, what is here? Oh, I would have missed this. Storybook. Alright, I think I got everything. Unless, hold on. What lays here? Many again. What up? Well, if I find out, I'm going around. <laughs> if I find out, I'm going the wrong way. Not saving. Oh, if I'm going around circles, I'm going to be so upset. Like, if you tell me. <laughs> Ah, uh, I hope that's not the case. Hold on. Alright, Manny, I'm gonna go around. I'm not jumping down. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? Am I supposed to go there? I feel like that's the wrong way. No. Man, you're trying to confuse me, man. Alright, let's try... Mm. There was a way to go up and I chose not to go there. Alright, saving for a reason. 
this is man hold on i remember this thing Oh boy, okay. So I have to go somewhere else. Alright, forget it, forget it. Forget it. I don't want to go down. There is another pathway, and I just don't remember how to get there. Hold on. Alright, I want to go around. Forget you, forget you. Like, where else am I supposed to go? Yeah, this is the pathway I was supposed to go earlier. Hopefully this means I'm going the right way now. Or I go there. Ah, if, if I'm going around. Oh, wait, is the ghost there? Oh, ghost. Thank you. Wait. Alright, cool. Oh, it's saving. Well, at least we're going the right way. And oh Don't fall. Don't my fall. gosh. Don't fall. It's the sudden stop at the end that I'm worried about, Dicey. Safe to say we're no longer in uh, the cardboard area now. I got so much money, I won't be using them. I feel it too, Dicey. You get close to it and it's like every bone in your body is warning you to keep away. The goo, almost like it's living or used to be alive. What did Dicey say? Alright, where are you leading me to? It's that ghost. Oh, oh, that's, that's going to be a long fight. I've got a card up my sleeve, in my chest, up my nose. Uh, that's a bit you got. Uh, no. I think, well, everywhere. Let's trade. Nothing to trade for right now, dude. Ah, uh, it's gonna be a long fight. Okay. I just saw the X. There you go. Alright. Alright, here we go. Hey, buddy. Bring them all to center. I'm gonna use that. Uh, oh, hold on. Let's go, let's go. I did it. Power up my. Oh, I can't. I can now. Hold on. Boom. Got him. All right. There's another storybook that's jailed up. All right. Did any of these gates open for me? This one? Oh, I hope I'm going the right way. It looks like it. Or did I jump down from here already and... Oh, yep, I jumped down from here and... Tell me I ran around. Come on, this place. This place is so annoying. Alright, that area is jailed. Alright, did I come from here? Or did they all lead to the same spot? Ah, okay.
I think this is the most frustrating level yet, because I feel like I'm going around in circles. I'll be taking that. Seymour! Is that you? Seymour? Seymour! Is he... <laughs> You're alive! Oh, is that you even? I was just dressing my eyes. <laughs> Seymour, your eyes. They didn't even make it about a number. They just took all three. I'm gonna get you out of here. <coughs> no, even you can't. There's too many. You'll never be able to. <laughs> what are you doing? Run! Careful, even. <laughs> oh, run. That's cute, man. Run. No. No. Oh, whoa, no. Hold on. Alright. Follow me. Follow me. Dude, you'll be fine. Just let me uh, do my thing. Alright. Oh, nope. Are you hiding? No. 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 Alright, we're gonna... Put right, a pin on that. I'm gonna use you. There you go, that's what I wanna see. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> You're even tougher than I knew, even. The nanny's gonna pay for this. How did you know Nanny Fortuna caught me? It was either her or the queen, and she does the dirty work. <laughs> so she does. She caught me in Forberg. Captured me, tried to get me to talk about you, but I didn't tell them anything even. Told them my name was Seymour, not Talkmore. <laughs> that's when... That's when she started taking my eyes. But what about you, even? I, I thought you were going home. W what made you change your mind? I realized. Realized what? That I could go home and live a sorry life, or I could go forward and fight for what I believe in. Wow. Nicely said, my friend. The Queen. She's more powerful than you think. And from what I've overheard, your sister has changed. She won't be what you expect. Oh, I'm sorry, even about all of this. We adults messed up the world, and somehow it's been left to you to fix. A child sent to face off against the most twisted and dangerous being and random, and it's, it's not right. I'm sorry I can't stop you, even. And I'm sorry I can't help. There's always hope, Seymour. There is. Whatever's happened to your sister, 
I, I don't think it's gone all the way yet. Just be careful. There's nothing I can do to help you now, especially given my uh, current condition. You know, a guy called the Visionary gave me this magic eyeball. Oh, 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 thank you. Now, all we have to do is survive Nanny and the Queen and her minions, and we'll fix everything. Let's go. Hey, whoa. Seymour, you're, you're in no condition to fight. You need to rest. Hey, I can't let you do it alone. I'm not alone. Seymour, when this is all over, there will always be a place for you in one town. I'd, uh, I'd like that, even. Alright, that was pretty good. We saved Seymour. What is this? Dice Slice. It takes two to create a sizzling thread that slices through any being caught in its way. The corroding fun lasts 30 seconds. Alright, you know what? I might use that. Uh, hold on. There was... Prior to me going up there, there was an area. Or is it up here? Or is it here? There's an area that had a storybook but it was blocked off. Let me see if it's still blocked off. I'm. I'm supposed to find someone here. No, Mr. I, I don't know, Dicey. But I know they're here somewhere. I'm going somewhere else now. I'm Sure. All right, well for now guys this seems like a good stopping point the royal dungeon All right, so if anything we end the video here for today You can imprison my body, but not my spirit <laughs> I'm always getting interrupted, but yeah, I'll end it here for today. Thank you all for watching And we'll start off again in the next one